Ugandan legislators voted late Wednesday to amend the country's constitution to allow 73-year-old Yoweri Museveni to extend his rule, potentially guaranteeing him a lifetime presidency. A provision in the current constitution limits the age of a presidential candidate at 75 years, which would have made Museveni ineligible to stand for re-election in 2021. On Wednesday, legislators ended a protracted and chaotic process to remove that age limit, voting 315 to 62 in favor of the amendment. Opposition lawmakers say they will continue to oppose the amendment. From Parliament to the streets of Kampala, there has been mixed reaction to the move. I'm disappointed that our own constitution, which is supposed to be durable, as it is stated in the preamble, has been amended just like that. This bill is like any other normal bill. It's not special. It's like any other bill. And to us, it is normal business. There's nothing strange about it. Bill will not help this country because even some few in RM, they have already gained from this bill. But Ugandans who are suffering like us, we are not going to gain anything. It is just for only seven for the one who is going to gain on it. We don't have political future in this country from up to date because first of all, we say it's a military dictator. He's the one who's tempered with the constitution. Everything's under him. When you look at security, when you look at the, all the institutions, even the judiciary, even the electoral committee, everywhere is under him. He's the one to say, pass it. What next after you have touched the constitution? What next after you have broken the hearts of Ugandans? Now, Wednesday's vote was the second time the Ugandan parliament has changed the constitution to allow Museveni to extend his rule. In 2005, they voted to remove a limit of two five-year terms, which blocked him from standing again. Several African leaders have amended laws designed to limit their tenure. Such moves have fueled violence in countries including Burundi, the DRC, and South Sudan.